Morning tubers, it's Wednesday, what, September? I don't know what the date is. Alright, cold these down. This is a uh, water shield for the door panels. This keeps popping out. I had to glue it in, I think. The clock's going off. So they're cleaning out the bench. I gotta put put the place to put door panels down because I gotta start fixing these. These are see how flimsy they are? Yeah. This one's solid, but yeah. Uh let's see, we gotta tighten up the electrical in this door. That door is done. Speakers are out. A seat for the passenger side's there. Or the seat adapter. Let's see, do we got anything over here? Armrest right there. Uh, seat belts and so forth. And we haven't taken this apart. Well, I might as well do it on camera. Let's see what this came out. And we'll take and cut this loose off because I don't care for it. So yeah. So yeah, that that put it back together nicely. Yeah, we'll sit here and let it sit here for a minute. So yeah. So you know what my day's gonna be filled like. So that's gonna be it. We gotta figure out what we're gonna do on these. You guys gotta remember, I didn't have panels for most of the car when we did get it, so yeah. So, let me get organized, do a few things, and uh, when I get some more, I'll bring you guys back. Later. All right, we got them back in and we super glued them. I mean, it's, they're going to be there. I think I'm going to end up super gluing that one because most of these are in the position that they're in. Yeah. So, yeah, this one's setting up. This is my miscellaneous bag of see, channels and stuff. You've got some armrest screws in there. Speaking of that, hole, hole, hole for armrest. So we'll need to cut those. So get the exacto out. So and I did show you this, didn't I? Too many projects going on at the same time. Yeah. This settled out, but still it's a little floppy still thinking of something that I could sit there and put on there to reinforce it and I'm going to take a razor blade and cut this all off because again it's probably going to get peeled off when we sit there and decide what we're going to do for the color so and that's why I am hanging on to the, those fuzzies right there so okay that's the update for now we just keep plugging away at it like it's going to be slow but it's going to be steady. I suspect we'll get this on. Need to open up this because I'm going to need one of these when we get this on. Uh, again, I'm thinking of uh, how to strengthen this up a little bit. You know, it's going to be down, and then there's going to be the, where is it, because I did it for fold down seat models and for convertibles, like these panels to use that, but then, yeah, there is that panel, 
So then you sit there. So I think what we need to do is fire up the air compressor, get an air mask on, and let's cut this off. Also, the other thing you're thinking about, could I take this and reinforce the one I got there? That's another thing to think of. So, that's what we're going to end up doing next then, making a mess. Alright, you can see where I'm at. Bring you back when I got some news to show you later. Now you know where the seats are stored. <laughs> This is all the uh, the weather proofing panels that were all rolled up in that roll and so they get flat so they'll be here for a day or two so and these are all the boxes that the seats came in we got large garbage day tomorrow so they'll take those tomorrow but yeah that might be going in today hopefully with that waterproof membrane drying in the uh, living room or not drying but folding out or laying out in the living room so it gets straight I took this out and cut it off so uh, this was the driver's side one and I'm just wondering I don't know we'll see What I need to do is find the passenger side one. Where did I stick that? Yeah, now we got to play in search of. Is it in there? We need salt yet? Uh, I could possibly get a bag in there. Yeah. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. So yeah, we can trim this off, start playing with this piece while we're waiting on that uh, waterproof stuff to lay flat. But I'll need to find where I stuck that. Okay, not there, not there, looking up there, looking up there, looking up there. Seatbelts are the last thing to go in, so yeah. Well, rather than boring you guys with me trying to find missing car parts, is it in this? No, it's not in here. Ooh, eyeballs. Yeah, so. Uh, let me put you guys up for a minute and let me play in search of. Talk to you later. This is where I was saying I wanted to redesign this back area, this corner here, per se. But I've got to figure out how to do it. It was okay what I did the first time, but I think I can improve on it, and that's what I want to do. You can see how this is... Yeah. So... Yeah, so i got to figure out do, on this, do I want to continue it, see it all the way up there, or what do I want to do there? It's a whole bunch of stuff here. Just make it, get a couple more of these and just get the end and cut it, and I don't know. I don't know. Plastic pipe. Yeah. Yeah. But this is where we're at now. Uh, no sense in doing anything else. I'm trying to keep busy because we we're waiting for those membranes to dry up. Uh, tonight I'll do the wiring in that door. But here I wanted to keep busy and see what's here. So yeah, we want to bring it back to roughly right there to this edge. So yeah. I don't know. We'll think of something. Pedestal is where the uh, rear seat folds down and mounts to. It's a real simple hinge setup. So, yeah. Alright, here goes some thinking. Get some more cardboard. Let's cut out some pieces later. Morning tubers. It's what, almost 9.30? already been to Home Depot once 
These are number 12 by uh, 3 quarter and it's the screw the armrest together right there and the screws go right there okay three quarter or too long need to get half so we're off to Home Depot sometime today in the travels got that got these laying out in the living room floor and this one's the passenger side and that's the side we're working on it's pretty well straightened out a little uh Let's see, what have we got? Gorilla tape. We'll slice it up. Yeah. A little Gorilla tape. Get a brand new razor blade out. And uh, get this hung on the door. Uh, I did do some trimming on this panel last night. Seeing where this is going to fit, I got to trim a little more off of there and play with it some more. And then uh, we're not going to put the rear seat rear seat back in. Uh, I got to figure out this what we're going to do here. I still I wish I hold on, hang on for a minute. Uh, Sorry about that, I needed something to point with. Look, from here, over here, right in here, we need to make a panel. And it's got to come off of this panel and this panel. But then you got to sit there and make it to where you can slide it in. From, you know, it's still removable. I'm not going to do anything that's going to be permanent, especially when a panel is concerned. And we got to figure out the back going across which will probably be easy and that'll pretty much take care of the back but it's this area here and the back is way back here we need to make a panel to go across here yeah so all right so when I get more I'll bring you guys back later yeah the weatherproof membranes back off because of this. And this one. This one's not bad. This one will hold. This one threads in pretty good. It's, yeah, it's these two that I'm worried about. So what I was thinking is maybe take a quarter inch nut cert, put it in there, these are supposed to be self-tapping, roughly. I mean, look at the end. I took a... Took a quarter by 20 nut cert and I stuck it in a vise. And this is going to be real fun doing it one-handed. And I got it to catch and start threading until the nut search started turning into vice. And I didn't want to clamp it down anymore because of, uh, see, it started threading on. It started cutting its threads. So, yeah, I'm thinking, i got a piece of steel. i got a whole bunch of nut certs. Now I can't get it off. But you get to see it starts threading. And I'm thinking self-tapping, it'll cut its own, yeah, I can't get it, start cutting its own threads. So the only way to find out is drill a hole, set the nut cert, and see if that works. If it does, yay. If not, then it's the welder and cutting up the hole, or filling the hole in a little bit more with a little weld. And I don't want to do that because I'm no good at doing that, you know. What did Clint say? A man's got to know his limitations. Me taking that welder and sitting there filling in a little bead, I'll end up plugging the hole. Alright, before I start really start babbling, later. I don't know what happened, the camera just stopped. So anyway, we'll get a 3H drill bit, drill those out, put nut certs in, put the weatherproof membrane back on and get ready to install the panel. 
and then uh, yeah we'll go from there more in a minute hey tubers these are quarter by 20 nut certs so once this gets going and starts cutting threads come on Tom I can't I'm not good left-handed it out keep going just like you're you're uh, chasing threads or cutting new threads but yeah that's gonna hold same thing here this one was still pretty good Besides, we're getting a little close to the hardware, and I don't know if it's sticking out. We'll sit there and uh, affect it. These two spots didn't. So, well, I'm going to finish chasing those down and uh, vacuum out the bottom of the door. And then, uh, what else? Put the paper on. Maybe put, yeah, put the door panel on. More in a minute. Later. Well, that's as far as I got. <clears throat> and I found I got to order some parts and they're on order and I don't know when they're going to be here so well I haven't got a confirmation on my order yet so so what I decided to do and I've been kicking this idea around in the back of my head is turn around and mount the door panels exactly that like I have the uh, the panels in the council so in other words the door panels would be mounted like that the button head allen screw going all right here now this r red represents where the factory mounting holes are and everything and I didn't want to mess with those so that's those so I wanted to stay away all I'm going to do is use a, this is a 10 30 second screw so I'll use a 10 30 second insert I think that's gonna look cool and then it'll match the the console so this is it for today I gotta go in and see if I got a parts conf confirmation and uh, then I'm gonna order some button top screws and uh, washers chrome of course and uh, I think that's gonna look neat started an inch and a half then five and five and these were the original the ones I put in on the corner so I left them there so about six and a half 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 and, a half. and then same thing same screw right there and then five five an inch and a half so that'll be it for today's video I want to thank everybody for watching and subscribing and uh, see what tomorrow brings um, now nah, we'll run this one. I won't load it up tonight. Everybody have a good evening. Later. Morning tubers. It's uh, going on 7.30. I've been up for about an hour or so. Uh, last night marked out the uh, driver's door. And... Uh, still waiting on parts. Well, we'll see what happens. And I put this down so we can adjust the height of uh, <coughs> of this panel. So I got to bolt that down, sit in there, play with this panel, and see where we're at. So I think we need to start this today. It hasn't been running a month, so yeah. So we'll take all that off of there and uh, fire it up. So. Not much going on. We're waiting on parts, so that's the big thing. These are probably going to get trashed. Might take the hardware off them, but yeah. Totally different concept and design going on here now. Alright guys, later. It hasn't been running a month. 
and I still got a slight header leak. Okay. One of the two. I don't know which one. He's tightening the shit out of his bolt. kick on then we'll shut her off still waiting on parts for the doors uh, we are working on I worked on that bingo speak of the devil okay all right real quick been working on that panel got a seat down got to raise up that armrest a little bit and see where it's going to lie on that panel and that's what we're tinkering with today. Later. Hey, tubers. Use some CA quick set. It's now part of it, but not 100% because I can pull it off. But it helps when you're sitting there trying to uh, mock something up and figure something out. So next we'll put it in the car and I'll bring you guys back later all right now we got to figure out what we're going to do here <clears throat> so we could come across and then curve and line in but then what are we going to do about the rest of the hump and then that's where the attachment to the so we'll have to clean that up too So do you want to can encapsulate all that? And that's where the seat latches, or at least to where the stud screws into. Yeah. All right. We're going to play around. Uh, I'm just using this for fill work. We're waiting for parts on the door. Uh, they should be here Monday, and uh, we'll be able to rock and roll then. But in the meantime, I'm going to do this, and i got a few other things in the house I want to take care of. We still have to figure out, we have to make a pad for here, and then way in the back. There's got to be something. But then, look at, see that right in there? Yeah. So, I guess when I cut four inches out of the trackage package tray, I welded it in pretty good. So, okay. Alright guys, uh, I'm mumbling, and I think this is going to be the last video on this series. Uh, I am going to get some uh, paper, yeah, construction paper, and we're going to get a roll of scotch tape and sit out here and build something and see what it looks like. And when I do that, I'll bring you back. The seat will stay in because this will tell me how to do this because then I'll be able to do this side and then duplicate it for that side so and I did see something I need to adjust this window that way just a smidge yeah okay I want to thank everybody for watching subscribing and of course leaving comments and uh, let's think I'm going to, tomorrow I'm going to go to a couple car shows or I'm going to go see Kenny Kenny I think is out at the uh, 
at the dam tomorrow. So I don't know if I want to go all the way into Boulder City. But, uh, yeah. You guys have a good weekend. Uh, if I get anything new, I'll bring you back later.